Well, so no Hamish in today, but he's left us in the capable hands of Tracy Lee. Welcome, Tracy. Thank you for having me. Lovely to have you here. You're the co-curator of the Resine Architecture and Design Film Festival 2016, okay. which has been going for quite a few years now. It's his fifth year this year. Yeah, it really excites me, this, and I'm pleased that you've come in to explain it all. So what does a co-curator actually do? Um, we're part sleuth, part seductress. We have to um, scour the earth and find all the best films that have just come out and then watch hundreds of hours of them. And, um, and then we choose the best ones to bring down to New Zealand Auckland uh, audiences. There's 19 films we've brought down this year. So how do you go about choosing them? What's the criteria? Um, I mean, we want something, you know, you want something gorgeous, but, but we want more soul than that. So all of these stories have got really beautiful narratives. There's some great um, kind of poetic, there's some humanity in there and, and communities, I think, too. We've really tried to take it away from just being buildings and really bring some of the... Mm. I was going to ask you about that because I'm the type of guy that goes to yeah. open homes in the weekend <laughs> just Guilty to be nosy. Also, yeah. um, so, you know, if you're a fan of, say, Grand Designs, yes. will you be a fan of this film festival? No, you totally will because there's a, there's a wonderful sense of stepping behind the scenes and you really do follow the journey. Some of these are filmed over a long period as well. One of the films, um, Fogo Island, they go right from the inception and the vision of it and you kind of you get the trials and tribulations. But, but you also get um, a really rich story of, you know, Fogo set on, on Newfoundland. So you get this great sense of, they're, they're gorgeous. You're going to places that you haven't mm. been. There's some Brazilian modernism. So you're kind of in places that you haven't not necessarily um, been faced with before. And I love the psychological side of building and architecture, mm -hmm. you know, how it affects people's lives. Is that what some of these movies are talking yeah. about? Yeah, um, we're really interested, and I think especially in Auckland now and Christchurch with the rebuild, that whole notion mm -hmm. of like being aware of spaces and, and planning for the future. So a lot of the films are also about different ways to live. So Barbacania, thinking about communal living. Um, mm -hmm. There's a great Chinese film, um, um, double happiness, which is kind of looking at how you try and create new spaces and, and nod to the future. Yeah, that really a, caught my eye actually. It's, it's a double happiness. It's a lovely tale of a, um, a South China town that um, replicated an Austrian water village. Wow. It's, 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 really, <laughs> um, it's fascinating really because when you think about movies about buildings, mm. you think that they, it's hard to visualise how you can get a whole film festival about it, but these stories are a lot more than there's, just that. Yeah, there's a lot of Good architecture freaks. And I think too, that's part of the mission is also just trying to make it that it's not just, this is not something for architects and planners. Yeah. It's, it's something that, you know, we, these are spaces that we live in mm. and communities and, and, and how we go forward. So it's about how we think about how, how we want to do that. And we are, we are house mad in this country, aren't we? We love talking about houses, so this is taking it to the next level. Um, and I'm so pleased that it's going not only to Auckland, but also covering the entire going country. down the country, yeah, yes. Yeah, Wellington, Dunedin and Christchurch also. All the details are there on screen right now. If you want more information about tickets, go to rialto.co.nz. Tracy, thank you so much for joining us today. Thank you for having me. See you soon.